President Trump today awarding the nation's highest military honor to a Vietnam War hero. <laughs> Captain Gary Rose, a combat medic, repeatedly risked his life running back into fire to save others. Today's Medal of Honor ceremony coming as the president reignites a back and forth debate over his condolence call to the family of Sergeant LaDavid T. Johnson. His widow, Myesha, speaking out about that now infamous call. That will hurt me the most because if my husband is out here fighting for our country and he risks his life for our country, why can't you remember his name? On Twitter, President Trump insisting he spoke Johnson's name from the beginning without hesitation, but not speaking to shouted questions, asking whether he regrets that Johnson was upset. Thank you. Thank you very much. And from the administration, few answers about what led up to that deadly ambush in Niger. On Capitol Hill, that search for answers now joining other priorities, including a GOP tax reform plan. The Wall Street Journal reporting one proposal could slash tax-free contributions for 401k plans. But today, President Trump tweeting he will not touch the 401k, promising it stays. And President Trump is set to head to Capitol Hill tomorrow to talk tax reform and other agenda items with his party, still hoping for a major accomplishment before the year ends. Lane Alexander, NBC News, the White House.